Welcome to Cash Tech. Today I will show you how you can draw a science hard wave form using Excel sheet. Mm, first of all, using a science hard wave form, you have to uh, declare the intervals from 0 to 360 degrees, which is very quite simple. I will choose a starting angle here 0, and then I will start from 0 and then just add 1 plus 1 using the formula 1 is equal to E5 and just simply you can select and drag up to 360 degrees okay so this formula will be keep on repeating itself and up to you will go at the end up to 360 degrees I will come back okay after that I have just declare here sine of x here i will take a new variable which is called as amplitude i will choose choose it here as 100 so what i will do here so instead of 100 i will choose here this formula okay similarly i will choose this formula which I can later on change it so simply then you need to drag and drop I will just uh, just bear with me I will explain the formula here first of all I will just drag it it will copy the formula automatically up to 360 now we are very near okay so 360 oops there is some mistake let me check what's the mistake here so this formula is uh, e3 sine of radian f5 okay what uh, radian is doing here this excel is calculating and the sign formula in gradients where uh, whereas i have declared it is in degrees so uh, what i have done here is i am changing degrees to radian and then the formula is used in excel so here my value is correct so we'll see what's happening here. okay he's taking the it's uh, at, the, at this place the sign is taking the next uh, value okay and that's why it's showing zero so I have to correct it so what I can do to correct this is very simple so one option is mm -hmm, F3 okay so I will choose as 100 and drag it up to the end okay so now it's a formula is is correct now you can see the formula has been drawn again I will open the formula let us see how I have declared it E3 is the magnitude of the waveform the peak value the sign is a formula radian here is because I have used uh, declared the values in degrees we 0 to 360 degrees which we are normally using it so um, I'm just converting to degrees to radian and then simply to the sine and then simply into the magnitude so the, the, the formula is now pretty much clear so now you can see the waveform is drawn like this so if for example I change the start angle to 30 degrees just press 30 now the waveform you can see is starting at 30 degrees which is quite easy then I make it to 0 Again, you can see the waveform has been changed. Okay, you can change the amplitude or the peak value. 
now it's 80 you can change it to 40 now it has been changed to 40 this is a basic tutorial which is showing you the how you can use uh, uh, Excel sheet to draw the sinusoidal waveform uh, using the same method you can draw cosine waveform uh, and other waveforms uh, you can also draw the amplitude modifications that I will show you my next uh, videos I will keep this Excel sheet as an uh, in, in, in the comment uh, of the YouTube video so please uh, like my video and follow my video on cash tag thank you very much